Us. Hi guys, welcome to our session tonight, coming to you live all the way from Adelaide, South Australia in Australia. My name is Tracy Pierce. And uh, my name is Adam Pierce. And uh, tonight we are going to run a Kihon based Kumite session for you guys, which has loads of uh, offensive techniques and uh, some Ziki, uh, Ziki Waza. We are currently getting some phone calls, apologies, from people uh, that we can't uh, take. Um, yeah, look, tonight's session, we're going to focus a lot on, I guess, offensive techniques, uh, some of the Zukiwaza that we'd all be familiar with, uh, some defensive for those techniques, then hopefully incorporating them into what we call a Gon Sen or a Sen no Sen uh, situation. Um, I think from our own point of view, uh, that a lot of um, a lot of people that were, that were train karate, we have different, uh, I guess, reasons for doing it. Some of us might be competitors, some of us might be running dojos, some of us might have just started. But uh, above, within all of that, um, the, the focus and the intention of the training, the dynamics of Shotokan karate, are something that we can all can do. So tonight's session or today's session, wherever you are, um, please try and remain as focused as you can. Uh, remain as loose as you can and as dynamic as you can uh, and really push yourself uh, to the point where uh, that, is, that is the character development of, of karate. This is what we really want uh, you know, people to do. It's the ultimate aim of karate, to develop your character and we do that through our hard training. So um, I hope you guys enjoy. Uh, train hard. Feel free to get a drink break or modify anything that you need. Um, but it's a, it's a pleasure on behalf of Tracy myself. Thank you, Martin. Yes. Uh, thank you, everyone yes. at home. Uh, and I really hope you guys enjoy this session and uh, yeah, work hard. So we'll, we'll bow in uh, formally. If we can face the front. Hey, Shawnee. Ray. Us. Afghani. Ray. Us. Now we are in our little shed here in Australia. Um, it where is we raining train at and the it's... moment, so we have to use our voices a little bit more. So please excuse the uh, the noise on the roof. Us. So okay. um, please enjoy, and we'll try and uh, and speak loudly for everybody. Hey, let's okay, go, guys. Okay, warm well, up, just jumping. Nice and loose, side to side, punching out. I hope everybody's keeping well around the world where you are. Staying safe. Washing those hands. Sanitizing. Being nice to others. Absolutely. We're lucky here in Australia. We are zero cases of coronavirus in the whole state. Nothing in LA. We've been pretty strict, so we're back to usual training at the dojo. So happy days for us here. Here, moving. Get those arms nice and warm. Everyone, uh, set right arms forward. Nice big rotations. And backwards. Just remember, guys, please modify any of these drills if you have any injuries or if you're nursing anything. Uh, that restricts you from doing certain things, please. Elbows. Heels back. On the way. If, uh, is everybody able to, to hear us? If you guys can hear Tracy and myself from back, can someone just give us a thumbs up? <laughs> just to make sure we're speaking loud enough over the rain. <laughs> I hope, uh, hope that's okay. Okay, let's go. Out to the side. Turn your palms up. Nice and loose. It's going to be a lot of punching today. Not too many kicking. No kicking actually. Watching some of you guys kick from here. Claudio, <laughs> fantastic. Side. Nice and loose. Rotate those hips. Stretch out. 
Stretch up. Hey, good job. All right. From here, feet a little bit wider than shoulder width. We're going to walk out onto our hands. We're going to do three push ups, walk backwards, and three squats. A each. Out. Three push ups. Two, three. Walk back. Three squats. One, two, three. Hey, I'll get me. Try to get your arms moving quickly. Up. Up, up, side, back, up, up, she, back, one, two, three, last one, hey, go, three, back, one, two, Good job. Nice. Thanks in and out. <laughs> when you warm up, try and make sure you warm up with a little bit of energy. So you can set your brain, set your feeling for your karate. Wherever you are in the world, today is the time, it's the time for you and your own training. So don't focus on anything else that's going on in your life. Enjoy your training. Work hard, into out, or out to in, sorry. Roll up those hips. Alright, so alright, down on the ground. Just hands on your elbows, okay, just relax slowly, side to side. If you prefer to lie back on your back, especially if any back injuries, hip injuries. Pull up that lower back. Okay, right, all right. So, all right. The legs up to the side. Hands forward. Straight spine. From here, hand back. Each. Knee. Keep your shoulders down. Breathe deep. Sun. Right, good one. She. Go. Rook, Sitch, Hutch, Kill, Je, Shank sides, Aich, Ni, Sun, Shi, Go, Rook, Sitch, Hatch, Kuh, and Kuh. Okay, from here, hands out, legs up, down to the left, pull to the right. Left, right, each, knee, sun, she, go. Rock, Sitch, Hutch, Ku, Aja. Alright, and stand up. Straighten your knees. Okay, alright guys, so we're just going to start off uh, doing some static uh, Kazami Gyaku drills. So, what I want you to do is when you're doing this, we want you guys to focus on, when we're moving fast when we do these drills, we really want you to focus on the, the reaction to move as fast as you can without anticipation. So we're gonna start off slowly and then build up gradually. But more importantly, I want you guys to stay completely relaxed. Because we can't move fast if we're too tense, yeah? So, I want you to think about zero, 100. So zero to 100, back to zero, okay? Hey, everyone, hey, yoi. <laughs> hey, left arm, left forward, get them right, how's your Hey! Hey, starting out with your gaki hand out. So right hand out, left hand on your hip. Hey, kazami, on the spot. Hey, itch, gaki, knee. Itch, knee. 
Itch, knee, 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 yeah. hey! Hey, 10 more, a little bit more faster. Really focus on drawing that hip back. And when you come forward, we're really trying to focus on everything squeezing in. There should be nothing facing hum knee for here. Everything should be forward. Hey. Itch, knee. 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 Hey, no, there. Hey, Ashi Huntai, right leg forward. Hey, get up, Ashmet. Hey! Hey, right hand out. Hey, slowly, hey, itch. Knee. Close everything in when you punch. Itch. Knee. Itch. Because then you should be everything off. So you'll hit it on your hand all the way as far back as you can. Knee. Itch. Knee. Itch. Knee. Itch. Knee. Itch. Knee. Itch. Knee. Itch. knee. Yep. Hey. Hey, faster. Hey. Itch. Knee. 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 Hey. Hey, now there. Hey, yes, right? Good. So when you're using, when you're, you, from your gap is looking from your hip, making sure that your back knee is not too much facing out. You want to keep it as far forward as possible and just your hip that's twisting. Because from here, you need your back heel to use, light, you, to use your power to move forward in this direction. Okay? All right, here you go. Hey, oi. It's okay. Everyone's okay. Awesome. Hey, oi. Hey, left arm, left leg, get it right. Hey, Hey! Okay. So, from here, we're going to start from our, from our hip. Okay? Get the Suki from our hip. Hey. Each. Hey, back. Knee. Hey, back. Stop. Hey back. Sheep. Hey back. Rock. Hey back. Rock. Hey back. Sitch. Hey back. Make sure that when you're punching, you're not going backwards this way. All your power needs to be going forward when you punch. So your heel must stabilize to the ground and push forward with your hips. Awesome. Stop. Sheep.
Hey, just let it first. Hey, itch. Knee. Some, making sure when you bring your hand back, your front knee is not coming in. So transfer your weight a little bit more forward so when you punch, your knee is facing the same direction. Knee. She. Go. Go. Six. Touch. Good. Hey, Jeff. Hey. Hey, last ten. Nice and fast. Remember that rotation of that back hip as far as you can. Hey. Itch. Alright guys, hope everyone's good, I'm training hard, apologies for the rain, the shed we're in drips a bit so I might have to wipe up the floor. Really important, this training, you want to try and keep it physical, uh, keep you guys moving, working hard. So if you start to feel tired, don't compromise your technique, don't compromise your waza. Work on the points that you know you need to develop and keep those points. Uh, keep those points in your mind, but still push yourself. Yes. Only through really pushing yourself and pushing your body physically, your karate will start to adapt. Absolutely. You yes. develop the, the muscle reactions that you want to have. Awesome. Hey, hey. Yes. let's continue. Hey, hey. 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 Down right. Hey. Hey. From here, left hand, left foot comes back. Up. Keeping low. Why is it you on each? When you move, I want you to sweat on three things. Head shouldn't change. Okay? Your head go, your parallel, your hips, this line here, doesn't, don't move it off center. So make sure you tuck your tailbone in. Everything up in through the center. Relax your body and ground your, your legs. Third thing, keep your weight low and small. So when you move, shift back and then drive your leg in to the punch. Hey, knee. Push. Sun. Push. She. Go. Start working hard. Bro. Push. Touch. Two. Hey. All right. We're going a little bit faster. I'm going to mix up the timing. I want you to explode. You should be nice and warm by now. So as you move now, keep your weight here. Get your foot back. And as it's moving back, quickly transfer that foot and drive your leg. Yes. Everything nice and relaxed. Focus on explosion and dynamics. Eight. Stop. Knee. Time. Chief. Go. Push. Six. Hunch. Push. Curve. Jump. Hey. Stay there. A little lower. Down. Ten more. Eight. Knees. Push. Sun. She. Look up. Go. Front. Sit. Hush. Curve. Hey, Jer. Hey. Stay there. From here, come right there. Then we're going to go a little bit more relaxed, a little bit more slower. From a Kamai position, more fluid. Change. Punch. Back to Kamai. Each. Knees. Sun. Sheep. Go. Recover. Rock three. Six. Hatch. Kur. Hey. Hey. Now you might be thinking, might get fatigued, might be getting tired, but your mind is still fresh. Keep your mind focused. What's Forward, don't ever think about anything else. Just focus, make your karate dynamic. Hey. Ten more, faster. Hey. Eight. Knee. Tap. Chi. Go. Run. Six. Hunch. Curve. Hey, Jim. Hey. Stay there. Breathe and recover. Don't move. Last ten. 
as you move backwards now, with your front hand, I want you to block. Get down below, or easy key. Come on, Ted. Get down below, right. or easy key. Keep low. Keep smooth. Ten, nice and smooth. Work on your command. Each. Oh, make sure you expand. That, that punch. Knee. Sun. Keep your head up. She. Go. Rock at the same time as your leg. Rock. Back. Feet. Hutch. Two. And two. Hey. Hey, hey last ten. Hey, Are you speed and power, guys? Let's go. Each. Come on. Knee. Turn. Chief. Go. Hook. Feet. Hutch. Kill. Aja. Hey. Hey. Now. Yes. Hope everybody out there is, is going okay. Thanks to everyone from Australia for tuning in. You guys around the world. Okay, we want to keep it moving. There's a lot to get through this session. I don't want to fall behind time too much. You've got one more technique to do offensively. That's Uraken. Okay, we'll start off slow. Stay with us. Anyway, I got my Hey! From here. Same movement as Wanizuki, step backwards, hand around. I want you to completely <laughs> your side. Staying low, expand this. Keep your body moving forward and hit. Good job. Each. Nice guys. Knee. Each. Knee. Each. Knee. Keep it flowing. Each. One. Knee. Flow. Sun. Breathe. She loose. Is that contraction Four. expansion, guys? Rook. Teach. Hutch. Good. Hey. Hey, faster. Teach. Me. Sun. She. Go. Rook. Teach. Hutch. Good. Hey. Hey. No. Yes. So, doing your rock end. Make sure, nice and loose, nice and relaxed. The transition between moving forwards and backwards needs to be low. So don't come up too high. So you just come to high as your weight comes up, your weight drops forward. You need to just bring your hips back enough over your feet in any transitional movement where it's still in front of your grounded foot to be able to propel you forward. So awesome. make sure as you're moving, nice and loose and relaxed. But as soon as you're moving back, you're vulnerable. You need to be moving in as well. So just try and keep loose. Make it instant, like a sneeze. Boom! The technique is there. Awesome. Okay. The last 10 rocking. I'm going to change it up. Like the Oizuki, we came back and we got. Similarly, we're going to do the same. For our rock image. So, Yoi. Hey. I get on right point. Hey! So, from here, first movement before was up and out. Was this time, as you come back, your front hand's gonna make an agashi yuke, but I want you, instead of coming back, slightly to the side to create the angle. So, if your tape's coming in, coming off the angle, walking here, and your rock image. So your feet are going to make like a triangle. In front of your feet, at the front, two at the side. Head back, push across, strike. Push across, strike. And each. Boom. Maybe come back to your command. Knee, side, boom. Side. Good. Now feel the rhythm of landing, land and push. She. Land and push. Go, land, push. Rock, land, push. Finish, land, push. Down that foot. Arch. Good. 
Relax. Hey, Hey! Maybe a little bit faster now. Try and keep that weight. So your weight doesn't go there. The weight just slightly shifts, but keeps it moving forward. Hey, say it. Hey, bitch. Come on, relax. Knee. Sun. She. Go. Look. Fitch. Hush. Curve. Hey, Jim. Ten more, guys. Hey. Let's go. Itch. Me. Go. Sun. She. Push hard. Go. Look. Go. Fitch. Hush. Curve. Hey, Jim. Hey. No. Hey. Yes. Push. Us from everybody, everybody watching, it's great to have him on the board. Um, if you need a drink, get a quick drink now, we're going to have about a 20 second break. Well done. everybody okay that's for our offensive techniques we're going to come back to those later in the session just to make sure that we stick on time which are two minutes behind schedule so we have to keep moving next thing we're going to do now our defensive and we're going to use our defensives uh, with some combinations incorporating our basics and everything else as well awesome. okay. Right. okay guys so hey guys Hey, left leg forward, get a brush, mate. Hey! Okay, so for now, we're gonna work up and back. So what I want you guys to do is the one thing I want you really to focus on was what Sense Adam was saying before is your hair curl. So I don't want you to be moving like this and back. Okay, I want you to try and keep your posture as straight as possible when we step up and we step back. Because we're gonna be incorporating blocks and punches. So I really want you to focus on staying low, keeping your center of gravity low, and not coming high. Okay? Hey, stepping up, contract your arms together to this, at the beginning of uh, getting a right. Hey, each from here. So elbow to elbow, yeah, all the way back. Step back with your left leg, block with your right hand, get a right, gap as you can. Knee. Good. Hey, each, knee. Each, knee. Each, say low, knee. Each, remember what we went through at the start of the session with our hips, yeah? Knee, form, form. Itch, knee. Itch, knee. Itch, knee. Itch, knee. The last one. Itch, knee. Okay. Hey. Okay, a little bit faster. Yeah, nice and flowy. Hey. Itch, knee. Something. She. Go. No. Okay, we're gonna speed it up a little bit. 
10 months, 10 times. Really think about, I'm going to break the count up, but I want you to explode with your movements. So as soon as you finish your first Gakazuki, right hip back, Kazemi, and heel in, push forward. Okay, so I want you, every single movement you do is at 100%. Hey, hey, what? Hey, left leg forward, get on my back. Hey! Hey! hey. Still alright. Is everyone okay? Still with us. <laughs> awesome. Fantastic. Gary, thanks for joining me. Well done, guys. You're doing nice. awesome. Okay. Keep working hard, alright? Boss. Really, really important. You start to get fatigued. You start to lose your breath. That's great. That's where the training happens. Right? That's where you want to get to. You want to get warm. You want to get hard. And as soon as you start to feel that fatigue, as soon as you start to feel the, those muscles start to get tired, that's where you are getting your training and your benefit. You want to get there and you want to learn to operate at that point with as much efficiency and perfect karate as you can. Awesome. And that's how we get better. How we get better. Awesome. Hey. 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 Come on, I got him right. Hey. Hey. Hey, Mick. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Just seriously, from here. Back leg back. Yuriyashi. Get him right. Okay. Slight bend in the back knee. Keep up. Front leg forward, you're the Ashi. Yakuza. Okay? When you yaku, rotate your hips, keep your body square, but just extend your scapula. Just forward. So it's not short enough back. Just forward. So all of this muscle, this big lap behind, is in behind your punch. Nice and loose to start with. And each. Back. Come on. Knee. Back. Just keep it nice and fluid. Chi, go, go, breathe, bro, from the absorption with your back, sitch, hatch, ku, aiju, ashi, hantai, aiju, same thing again, each, back, punch, knee, back, punch, sun, chi, go, back, punch, bro, sitch, Hush, keep breathing. Good. Hey, Jim. 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 Hey, so just react to our voice, relax, back in as fast as you can. That one technique you need, boom, boom, to finish. Hey, horse. That's where we want to get to. Hey. Hey, come right there. Hey, horse. Sure. Get out right, get this if you're nice and fast. Let's hey, go. hey. Hey, each. Back, relax. Knee. Back. Sun. Keep the movement speed, don't shorten them. Chi. Ah. Uh. Go. Alright. Run! Feet! Fast in between, guys, that's some loose. Hut! Back. Curve! One more. Turn! Hey! Hey! 
Shut up. Hey. Hey. One more time. Shut up. Back camera right before Jack is a key. Me. Me. Visualize that punch coming. Block in going. Sam. All of your spirit. Chi. Work hard. Go. Come on. Run. Seat. Right. patch on the floor. Sorry guys. Would be embarrassing if we slipped over in front of the world. <laughs> that is how we roll. Okay. Hey. Hey, hey. Hey, come on. Hey. Hey, hey come on. Yeah. From here now, same feeling, okay? Center attack is coming towards us. Instead of breaking back, we're going to break our dangle using what we call our tice back with our inside hand, which is my right hand. I'm going to step across my left leg and block it. Get out right. Then I'm going to go forward to the center line and punch the opposite straight. Okay, from here, shot back to the opposite leg. Important point, your turning foot here, if you guys can see my foot. Okay, if I'm going to be punching straight here towards my target, that angle of the foot is where I need to take when I move to this position. So I want to be blocking, bending down and contracting into my hips with that foot straight. If my foot's out to the side, I'm taking that position here. I can't really use my hips and my knee is in a dangerous position to do injury. So make sure that same contraction of your gyaku we practiced at the start, that foot position needs to be taken here. The second thing is, get off of the line, but keep your body trying to move forward the whole time. So don't let your weight go to the right foot, get your right moving into that direction. So off the line and back. Each out. And nice and smooth. Each. Cross punch. Come on. Left foot across. Knee. Cross punch. Block as you step out. Punch as you step forward. Sun. One, two. Chi. Relax your body and recover. Go. Breeze in. Rook. Siege. Hunch. Ku. Aiju. Hey! A little bit faster. Each. Rise. Knee. Sun. Chi. Go. Look. Push, push, sit. Push high, come on. Hatch. Curve. Aiju. Now we're there. I have some. What? Now, if you're new, if you're new to training, or Perhaps, potentially, this might get too confusing with the full work from you. Please modify it, keep it basic. Yes. Just normal get on bright, yakazuki, and training is absolutely fine. Okay? We're now going to mix that up we're going to combine them both. Okay? So, you ready? Hey, sure. Get on bright, come on. Hey! Come on, there. Okay. From here, yuri yashi back, get on bright, yuri yashi forward, yakazuki each. One, two. Then to the left. Side block, punch me. Come on, okay. Opposite hand. Back is first. Each. Punch. Knee. Side forwards. Come on. Each. Back. Punch. Side forwards. Each. Back. Punch. Side forwards. Through the fluidity and the rhythm, we go one, count, all four movements. Nice and fluid. Ten times. Each. Come on. Knee. One, two. Breeze, four. Sun, one, two, three, four. Keep your body nice and straight. Hips on, she. Go, back. Brook. Teach. Hatch. Kuh. Hey, Jim. Hey. All right. Ten times. Maximum speed. You're going to mix up the count. Hey. In and back, side and back. If you need to keep up, 
Try and separate the two. In back, then side back. In back, side back. Nice and quick. Keep your own chin. Hey. Each. You are me. Sam. Chi. Go. Run. Keep up. Six. Boom. Stop. Hunt. Seconds. Go another one. Great work. Wait for time. So twelve. We are good. Now go to Colossi, Tommy. Yep. All right. Do you want to explain? Yeah. Okay guys, now we're going to move on to um, some Gornosen and Sendelsen timing drills. So um, if you're not aware um, of what uh, this means, I'll, we'll uh, explain it to you. So uh, with Gornosen, it's pretty much same as Kionipon Kumite, yeah? So blocking and punching, but in a freer kind of, uh, so for if you're competing, it needs to be done as fast as you can. So Kionipon ki Kumite, step back, block and punch. In a more free way, um, it's gonna be a little bit more uh, faster when you move through these movements. So, I'm just gonna demonstrate a couple of drills that we're gonna do now. So, if you don't have a part of that spine, I'm just gonna show you uh, with Adam Sensei at the moment. So, so I'm facing Adam Sensei. Hi, yo. Hey, come on. Okay, so, if Adam Sensei is coming through with a Gakazuki, okay, Chudan Gakazuki. Obviously, I need to shift my weight, so I don't want to shift my weight too far back so it ends up being yuriyashi, okay? So it's just pretty much, I want you just to pull yourself back a fraction, hey, each. Just so I'm here, hey, each. Hey, back. Knee. Hey, back. Some. Chi. Go. Hey. Okay, so from here, now we incorporate our Gakuzuki hands. Okay, many variations that you can do. You can take with Kazami or Gaku, but for this drill, I'm going to use a Gakuzuki. Hey, each. Hey, knee. Some. Chi. Hey, go. Hey! Okay, so it needs to be, you cannot get touched here. You need to shift from here, my body's here. Punch coming, just to here. Block just to here. And then you can move through with a Yuriyashi to Gakuzuki. Or, from here, one, two, Kazami. Okay? Very important though, not a shift back. Okay? Just from here, boom. Okay? So, what we're going to do is we are going to um, attack towards uh, you. And I want you guys, actually, I'll take you through the three phases first. So, two, two. Two, so back to the side. So, what we're going to do is one more time. Hey, yo, make my Okay, so from here I'm going to attack Adam Sensei. And we just did that same movement before, just previously to this. So you're going to shift back, Yuriyashi, get on right block to Gakazuki. Hey, each. Come on. Hey. Knee. Some. Okay, so that's pretty straightforward. Next one, he's going to move to the side. Hey, each. Knee. Some. Okay, and you can mix it up and go to the other side. Hey, each, knee, sun, hey, sha. Okay, all right, so we're going to attack. Sorry? You will attack. Sorry? You will attack. Yes, yes, I'm going to attack Sensei Adam. But I want you guys to think about one or three of those techniques. You can go backwards or you can go to the side. Okay? And what choice will do? I will. Yeah. One more sand is defending, so Tracy Sensei is going to attack you. What are your yeah. focuses on her? I'm going to do the defense, okay? So I'll be, I'm going to mix it up between the first Yuriyashi and Gaku, 
on the side, and gyaku. Okay, try and focus on Tracy Sensei. And if you get lost, what to do? You can follow me. Now, if you have a partner at home, if you have someone in your family you train with, um, that obviously you can have some close contact with. By all means, please try and please partner up. Um, if not, this is your opponent, very dangerous lady. Okay, move fast. Get out of the way, but 100% focus on her technique. Okay, hey. Guys, as well, after you do your, your technique or your counter, your mind might take one or two seconds to refocus itself, and you want to get rid of that that time where you're vulnerable or you lose your focus. Not only for a competition, real life, but to just completely be in the moment and aware. So, after you do your technique, straight away you come back to your zone chin and you're watching and you're ready and minimize any kind of time that you're off focus. Awesome. Okay, next one. Oizuki. Hey. Okay, if we can demonstrate. Oz. Oz. Hey, Oi. Okay, Tracy Sensei, okay, come right there. Hey. Okay, from here, Tracy Sensei is going to come Oizuki. We're going to do the same movements that we did at the start when we broke back and I blocked the Geno Mirai Owen Oizuki Jono. Okay, so slowly it's going to look like this. I want to time my block. As a punch comes on the second half, each second half. Well, oh, that's a really bad block. Nobody saw that. Okay, from here. Now, my timing and my distance is going to be a little bit different, especially if I have a partner here. I'm obviously going to be a little bit close. Okay, so when we move forward now, what I want you to do is if you have a partner here, okay, aim for the crux of their gear here, at the top of their chest, but you need to time your punch so that your hand extends at the correct time, your foot might not be extended yet. And what's going to happen is your weight is going to be behind your hand. Okay, so it's not together, body straight, boom, and then out after that. Okay, from here, we're just going to break back. Okay, next punch comes, each block, or is the key, break back again. Knee, block, or is the key, break back again. So what we're going to do, Okay, I'm going to come forward from Kamai there. Then we're going to come forward to Oizuki. As my punch is coming, and you see it, that second half, I want you to wait for it. Wait for it until that extension happens. As the extension happens, you are retracting. You're getting your body out, you're clearing my punch, keeping your weight not too far back, but accelerating forward and trying to minimize that time between that block Absolutely. and that punch. Okay, so I'll do the punch. Tracy Sensei. It's going to do that block. Switch on, let's go. Hey. Nice and quick. Hey. Each. Be back. Change your mind. Knee. Back. Sun. Do 
we fight this. See. Right. Go. Oh, you knew it was coming. Break up the timing. Come on, guys, keep up. Rook. Gonosen is very common in karate, in that Kihon Ippon Kumite, Gohon Kumite, Ju Ippon Kumite, we train that, we get used to defending and attacking. A lot of times, when people start to progress to showdown or black belt, um, they get very used to it, they get used to front hand blocking, back hand punching, mm -hmm. which is sometimes good to defend, sometimes it leaves you vulnerable in that you only have maybe one attack, that old famous mm -hmm. Kyakazuki. So, make sure when you're training your Gonosen, training your reaction, Trying to really be attentive to that movement and just, I guess, feeling it. For a lot of us that might not be maybe quick or older, um, this is something that a lot of people do, and especially if you talk about a flight or fight, which when you're under pressure, naturally that will come out for you. Yes. A lot of people that might be worried or scared are going to do that kind of sense. So if you're that person, you might not have enough confidence yet, please make sure that you train your gonna send well. Mm. But more importantly, is the Senosen. Yeah. Now the Senosen training requires a lot of courage. And Senosen means, as they start to attack you, bang, you meet them first. And you take it. The good thing with Senosen is, you don't necessarily need to be very fast to do it well. So but you need to have great timing. Right. You need to have great knowledge of your technique and your distance of your technique. And amazing reflexes and concentration and focus. Which is what we just did at the start of training. And if you train hard in your Kihan all the time and you have that intention of attacking strong and moving your fastest and being dynamic, your center stand should come quite naturally. The thing that might, I guess, worry you is going to be the distance or the size of the opponent. But you have to remember, your technique doesn't change. Your distance doesn't change. It's just Absolutely. doing the right technique the in right the time, time. At the, to, to make it efficient. So we're going to keep it pretty simple, still stick to the techniques that we've already done today. Um, we've only got about five more minutes. The first thing we're going to do is uh, we're going to go straight into our Gyakazuki again. So we're going to attack. Now, you'll find more often than not, us. sometimes come out there. When we're hey. fighting, people come to Gyakazuki, chase us into the Gyaku. First thing we did was we blocked out that, di that distance and then moved into our Gyakazuki here, with that punch here. This time, while the Gyakazuki comes, I'm going to be relaxed. Okay, and as it's coming, Boom, I'm going to fire my Kazemi, okay? For any competitors or people out there that might compete, a couple of points to notice, okay? That is, if, um, if I'm facing Tracy one more time, and if she comes in, a lot of people tend to move off of the line and turn their body, which is great, the punch is going to miss. But if your hands, if your elbow here stays neutral, the line goes past their head. And a lot of times, you'll, the, the judges will pick that up or you might miss it. Okay, not even that in the competition sense, but in a reality sense too. So just make sure that as you're going to come in, angle with that forearm directly straight towards that body as you're coming in. More often than not, your body, bang, lines up behind your hand. 
So really explode and extend that back leg when you're moving forward. When we're doing this and towards you, front leg is nice and light, back hand extends forward. Alternately, if you feel more comfortable doing an uraken, Tracy comes to Yakazuki as well. I move to the side, my hand's going to have a little bit more opportunity to create contact because it's not going to be able to deviate past as easy, it's still going to hit. So if you feel more confident going forward, uraken, which we practice, by all means do that. If not, as we're moving forward in our Yakazuki, bang, I want you guys Us. to Kizamazuki us. Hey, us. What's Trace? Hey, us. Okay, so. <coughs> Uh, let's say Tracy will go Gyakazuki. Boss. Boss. I'm going to go Senosen Gyakazuki. Okay, so as soon as she starts to move, I'm going to react to that. I want to beat her. I want to get there first. You guys are going to do the same thing. Watch Tracy Sensei. As soon as she moves, all your focus is on that. Bang. Remember, after you Kazami, straight back to your Zan Shin. Hey. Don't let your mind do that. Boss. Ten you times. Can nice and quick. Come on, keep going. Last nice there. Nice and fast. Let's hey. go. Hey! Hey! You do exactly the same thing. This time you want to react Senosen, taking us to our Kazemizuki. Okay? So what do you see all the time? Awesome. Uh, I'm going to go Kazemizuki. As I'm going to move in, Tracy Sensei is going to go Gyakazuki under me. Quickly. Come on, fast. She wants to get there. Extend that hand as I'm literally here, moving up. I'm trying to find that rhythm. I'm trying to find that rhythm, we then take off and then go. Just to demonstrate, nice and loose. Hey! In. Hey! In. Hey! Drilling your body in, making sure you can get in. Have the feeling of attacking forward. Even though you might be defending, you're still pushing, pushing forward. Going, yes, you come, you come, bang! As soon as they're moving, boom, all of your body is stopping. Hey, you killing. Good shot. Good shot. Hey. All right, I can't care. I want to go Kazami again. Tracy Sensei, would you want to go Kazami or go Geku? Oh, whatever you want, Sensei. Uh, let's mix it up. Uh, yeah, I'll go Kazami. I'll go Geku. 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 Alright, yep. right. react to my Kazami, guys. Get come underneath. Nice, alright, let's go. Hey! 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 Sometimes people move in different ways. Hey! Switch on straight away. Switch on. Hey! Everything looks and relaxed. Feeling forward. Hey! Three more. Hey! Three more. Hey! One more. Hey! Ashi and Tai. You always swing both sides. Let's go. Last thing.
Fantastic, guys. Fantastic work. I hope everyone enjoyed that. Got about two minutes to go. We're going to do a quick stretch at the end. Go a quick drink if you need. Otherwise, come and stretch with us. Well done. <clears throat> Alright, turn your arms. <coughs> nice and nice. I guess from our point of view, as Martin was saying just previous uh, to our session tonight, you know, karate for us, or for you guys as well, is what we enjoy, it's what we love, it's what we do. For us, there's, there's different reasons people do karate. Physically, you could be different, you might be tired. You might not have the, uh, maybe the abilities of younger, more flexible people, but your mind shouldn't change. Absolutely. Your intention doesn't get younger. Your focus ne you know, necessarily shouldn't really deviate too much. And you can always reach your limit in different ways than other people, but still push it there and still hold it there and be proud of the work that you've done. Absolutely. Knowing that you've gotten that little bit stronger, that little bit more intention. A lot of us lose, I guess, focus quite easily. The people that meditate would know it doesn't take long to, meet, to start to lose concentration and bringing in thoughts. Yeah. But karate is kind of meditative as well. When you're training your kion or training in your dojo, nothing else should matter. And you need to start, or you need to be able to be really be aware Things down, be aware of what your body is doing, your how it's doing it, and, uh, and what you can do to really, really make better. Okay, get to the point where if it's hard training, you know, just do one more, Absolutely. one more time, one more time. It shouldn't matter how tired you are because you can go home and you can rest. Yeah. You know, you can have, have your coffees, or yeah. your protein shakes, or whatever you're into. Okay, but push yourselves, okay, push each other. Raise the spirit of your club, Absolutely. raise the spirit of your dojo, and, um, and enjoy it. Mm. It's, it's a great thing. Mm. Okay, come on. Do you want to say anything? Yeah, guys, thank you for joining us tonight. I hope you guys have taken uh, something away that you can practice at home um, and work on that, whether it's speed, whether it's timing, uh, whether it's keeping low. Um, yeah, I, we just hope that, uh, you know, you've, you've pulled something out of the session and you can take that away um, and you can, you can work on that. Karate is a circle, so we never stop learning, okay? Yes. Always something to learn. Okay, we will finish up. Are you trying to eat, right? What's? Hey. What's going to eat? Right? What's? What's? Thank you guys very much. It's been, it's been fun. It's been, uh, it's been great. Uh, thanks for the great comments. And uh, yeah, it's, it's great to have uh, have everybody on board. And and I look forward to hopefully uh, another time to to work with everyone again. Well, let's take care, guys. Thank you, guys. Us, be Us safe. from Australia. Bye. Cheers. Bye. I have to make sure I do this. Pro